If you have the space, I invite you to close your eyes, take a deep breath, and run a visualization experiment with me. <sighs> with eyelids shut and in your mind's eye, imagine a white sphere or a bubble floating in a void. Don't see yourself in relation to the sphere, just see the sphere itself. Great. Now, as you breathe in, I want you to imagine this sphere getting larger, expanding evenly on all sides. And as you breathe out, see it contract. Try that a few more times, keeping your focus steady while simultaneously listening to the music. Inhale, the white globe grows. Exhale, the white globe shrinks. Keep your eyes closed for one more moment and see if you can notice that your mind has now been stilled, if only slightly. This stillness might make sense. Why? Well, in terms of colors and shapes, nothing is simpler than a white sphere. White includes all colors and a sphere is perfectly symmetrical no matter which way you divide it. Simplicity is the basis for all steadiness and lucidity of mind. There are many schools of thoughts here, but when I sit to meditate, my goal isn't to completely shut off the thought valve. That would be impossible. Rather, my aim is more manageable. It's to simplify the content of my thinking into an even and inconsequential trickle. What does this mean practically? It means allowing certain ideas and concepts to die. My desire for a specific material good, my attachment towards a project that I'm working on, my lust for being right. During meditation, I need to have the bravery to dismantle these stories. It's not that these thoughts aren't important. Some of them very well could be. It's just that the trade-off is too large. Winning an argument in your head, or getting lost in the conceptual fantasy of owning something new, or tying your worth to your perceived social status is not worth the mental instability or physical tension they bring. The cost of your thinking should never be your sanity. That price is too high. With that, here are your journal prompts for this week. First, what story Am I telling myself that's creating too much complexity? And second, what part of this mental abstraction am I having difficulty detaching from? It's as easy as that, y'all. By the way, I'll be hosting a breathwork event this Wednesday at 8.30 Eastern Time. The theme is called Noise Reduction and is all about quieting that chattering voice inside your head. The class is going to be very powerful. Tickets are limited and are linked below. Happy Sunday. I'll see you next week. Much love.